were high during tonight's HISD school board meeting. Teacher evaluations, vaccines, and libraries were all brought up. KPRC2 News reporter Corley Peel is outside HISD headquarters with what we learned about vaccines. Last year, Superintendent Mike Miles says there were 644 vacancies. He says right now there are more than 60, but some people attending tonight's meeting have concerns about the amount of certified teachers. Thursday's meeting started with people upset about repurposing librarians and libraries at NES schools. No music, no fine art. Even standing up with their backs turned away from Superintendent Mike Miles while holding books during his presentation. A lot of people took this survey. The meeting ended with the board unanimously approving majority of the agenda items, including the approval of a waiver to allow the HISD district to hire and employ assistant principals and deans without certification from 2023 to 2026. Superintendent Mike Miles says there are currently 63 teacher vacancies. He hopes to start the school year with zero vacancies. He says 87 teachers currently do not have certification. Teachers refuse to be HISD scapegoat and we reject any evaluation tool that seeks to silence teachers and does not teach does not treat teachers with respect. Based on a survey, he says 80% of teachers, 88% of administrators, and 81% of all respondents agree or strongly agree that teachers should be paid more than less effective teachers. To me, it is a slap in the face, number one, but also because the board is just a rubber stamp, Superintendent Miles says despite some teachers not having their certifications, he says they will be evaluated and trained properly. Their next meeting is September 14th.